Ali and Celine going one on one. What is it like to go somewhere that you are not used to going and competing for the first time? You know, I don't know if you've competed in another country, but even going outside of your own area where you live can be intimidating. Yeah, in 2018, I went out to the Dominican Republic, and I tell you, when you land somewhere, you're dealing with the heavy flight, the culture changes, you're worried about your passport, all kind of other things have nothing to do with the ring. You're not focused in it. And Celine looks very excited to be in here one-on-one -on -one with Alley Catch, but who knows how long that is going to last because there's always, always that sort of, hey, I'm competing against somebody who is well-recognized like Alley Catch. This is going to be huge, but then Alley Catch might forearm you and you might think a little different. Yeah, a, a hard forearm to the face will really change your perspective. Everyone has a plan. Oh. Nice. Yeah, I think Celine has been uh, studying Ali Ketch's moves. And I think she underestimated the hip strength of Ali Ketch. She almost popped a hip out. Yeah, she, she might have. And the size difference having an interesting effect in this contest. And what you're watching here, you might think, what is happening? That is Ali getting in the head of Celine because even though Ali has her fun in there, she knows exactly what she's doing. Yeah, Ali will punch you in the mouth with a smile on her face. So be cautious of Ali catch. So here we go, going to start it off again. As Ali definitely playing up that advantage she has as far as, you know, Celine having that off factor in her mind. No, Celine's not mentally all the way there. Catch is using that, using the size difference to her advantage. It's, it's a great strategy by Ali Catch. As a clean break. Celine's saying you're not very nice. Maybe she's starting to realize that these are, in fact, mind games. Celine seeming very cautious of mommy now. There's a boot to the chin. Oh, head scissors take over. Charges in, misses with a right hand and uh, Ali not missing with what she does better than anyone, but hold on. Celine ducks through. Spins around into an arm drag takeover. Really intelligent use of speed here. Just staying out the way of Ali Cash and getting her off balance. Off the ropes. Flatliner, at least a variation of it, makes the cover. And that was looking good for Celine, but right now, Ali, I think we were talking about Celine having that off factor. I think Ali is the one who is now starting to realize, okay, maybe I bit off more than I can chew. They have it now, Ali catch big bat breaker. Ali was trying to use a two factor strategy, trying to get use the mind games and then use the size. The mind games stopped working, now the size and the power. Oh, it's an effect. Alley catch in that corner. Distinct strength advantage here against Celine, using it as Celine goes down in that corner. And Alley, when she gets control of a contest, she is hard to figure out. And it, it's simply because she starts every contest with getting in your head. You think you have a strategy, she throws you off. Well, Alley said, if you want to call me not nice, let me give you an example as face first into that second turnbuckle goes Celine. Yeah, Ali Cat trying to get some coal in December. Being real rude, naughty, and not so nice in her assault against Celine's face. So many big debuts here tonight, including our first ever international Dream Match main event. But Celine right now with that back elbow, daring Ali Catch to charge in as Ali keeps trying over and over again. A lot of stubbornness. And forget about stubbornness. How about just a straight up boot? As Ali Catch does things on her own terms, she is afraid of nothing. She is not backing down from the debutante. She refuses. Ali Catch has gone against too many, too big, too fast, too experienced. Celine right now trying to utilize her speed, but has eventually has officially been grounded within this contest. And grounded, not staying that way for long as she is trying to get back up to her feet here. Celine jockeying for position here. Shot to the midsection, and there's a jawbreaker. Alley Cat trying to maintain head control, but wow, controls the head with a hip attack. Charges in again. Oh. Cannonball in the corner. 
made her a sandwich. Rushed her, hooks the leg, shoulder up, five minutes and of only a count of two. Five minutes remaining. And that shoulder up, I can only assume that was just, you're so acute, accustomed to kicking out as a professional wrestler. I don't think that shoulder should have raised up. She, she's not here right now. Now she definitely is on the back foot, on the defensive in this one, as making her debut here from Paris, France, is Saliba Alley Catch, letting her know that you're in mommy's house. Yeah, lo love definitely isn't in the air. Chin lock is well applied in the middle of the wide eagle, though. Salib slowly trying to get to a vertical base. Doing anything she can to get back up as Alley had in her mind a best of five series coming up with Shannon Lavangie, but she has to deal with Celine first. Right now, Celine again behind the bat. Big catch of the boot, big knee, and a strike to the gut. Off the ropes, lifts up that knee. It's a bulldog, and she is getting a second win here, Brother Greatness. Hey, I love a well-executed bulldog, and that was placed essentially out of nowhere. Knees to the back. Knees to the front. And she is on a roll here. Brings her to the center of the ring, but not enough. All of the 50 kilo frame dive directly into the base of the neck of Alley Cat. Alley's in a bad way, but Celine needs to keep the pressure on. Alley Catch and Celine one on one here tonight. Use that hashtag. Let us know what you think as the action is just getting started here at Wrestling Open tonight and every Thursday forever. Big shot, Celine. Oh, trying to trade bro blows with Alley. I don't know if that's a good idea. There's another one. Big shot, stun Celine. And now Alley is begging her for a fight. Asking for more shots and more shots. Alley, this is this is what she's about. Alley grabs that arm. She is firing up here. Off the ropes. Oh, wow. Double clothesline. Celine practically broke her own arm there. And Alley Catch excited at the attempt, bending down to her level. Misdirection. Celine in the air. Look at this. Cristo. The submission is locked in. It is in the center of that ring. This would be a shocking upset. La Crista, very difficult submission to be in. Alley able to muscle out of it. Oh, sits out, dumps her on her head. But maybe not. Maybe it was more of the shoulder on that one, and that is why Celine was able to get that shoulder up. Celine barely kicks out after a devastating take on the Misha Nuku. Alley Catch looking to wrap it up. Oh, spikes her with the pile driver. See you later. Alley gets the win. The time of the fall, eight minutes, 14 seconds. Here is your winner, Alley Catch. As Alley Catch able to overcome the debutante Celine here tonight. Really snappy pile driver. Alley Catch using strength. Using, using sensibilities and quality technique to get a victory. And right now, Celine on her way to the back. Well, somebody forgot to turn her mic on. What is this about? That's Paris. Well, we need Rich to help out here. There you go.
there's a challenge for next week. Paris Van Dale, an alley catch. Big challenge. And it looks like Alley has accepted that challenge. We're gonna see that next week, Brother Greatness. Beyond that side, we'll see what happens. Catch Van Dale next week. Well, I don't know if this is a game plan or Shannon is behind the scenes pulling the strings, but let's take a look at the recent history with Root and Lawless.